Welcome back to Exposing Human Trafficking. Um, this is a little bit part two about Jennifer Aniston. Um, I uh, didn't have enough room on the other video. Um, but when Brad came um, to Taos, New Mexico by Taos Plaza outside the Alley Cantina on August 7th of 2018, um, he was asking about Jennifer Aniston. And... Um, I said that what he had done to her was horrible and that he needed to fix it. And then shortly after that was when he decided after all these years that he needed to go apologize to her and make up with her, you know, get her forgiveness. Really? He has to be told to say sorry. He apparently didn't think anything was wrong with it. But that's how he is. He's sent people, third parties, to me because, you know, he wants to get back with me and um, kill me at this point. Um, and, um, you know, they're like, you know, well, you know, what can he do? And I said, he needs to fix it. So I don't, I don't think he can fix it. Can you fix something like this? Can you fix all of that porn that's out there that was made because I was gang raped and drugged and held at knife point and threatened? Can you fix the millions of viewers that have watched these videos? Can you fix the damage that has been done to my body? Can you fix the children that have been killed because he didn't want me to have children with anyone else and he didn't want me to go with anyone else? Can he fix the money that I've lost on a career that I worked so hard for that I had to pay student loans back? Can he fix my inheritance that was taken from me, from my biological father that died? that I had $1.2 million inheritance? Can he fix every night that I cried over him, over what he'd done? No. He doesn't even have the balls to come out and admit to what he did publicly. So... I don't know what his deal is. I know that he is just totally messed up. You know, his kids hate him. His friends are around him because they get stuff from him. What kind of life is that? It's not a good life. I've been poor because of him. And I've been happy. Because it's not about money. Money can't buy you love. Money can't buy you friendship. Money can't buy you loyalty. Money can't buy you anything. Yes, money's good. And I've had the life of luxury. I've flown first class and stayed in five-star accommodations. And had wonderful, delicious meals. in very refined restaurants. But it's not the same as when you got your friends around you. When you have people that love you, that want to be with you because of you. And it must be very, very sad to be in a place where people won't be around you because of what a creep you are and what a criminal you are. So there you go, folks. Give it a thumbs up if you like. Comment down below. Um, subscribe and hit the notification bell. And share, share this so that there's not one more victim of human trafficking. Thank you very much.